So hey everyone, welcome back to DV Tech. So you're back with a new interesting video. So in this video, we're going to be seeing how to install Bliss OS on your system. So if you're new to this channel, please do subscribe to the channel for more technical and interesting videos. So let's all wait and quickly get into the video. So in this video, we're going to be seeing how to install Bliss OS on your device. So all you need to do is follow my steps one by one. So I'll be teaching you step by step how to install Bliss OS on your PC. So let's not waste the time and quickly see how to install Bliss OS on your system. So the first thing you need to do to install the Bliss OS on your PC is open Google Chrome and type download Bliss OS. So you could find the first official website of the Bliss OS for PC. So you just need to enter it. So here you need to click on the download which is in the navigation bar. So you just need to tap on it and it takes us to the download section. So here are some versions to download. So I prefer you to download the version Bliss OS 11.3 GMS stable. So this is for 86 as well as 64. So as you can see I am highlighting the first one you need to download that. So now you need to click on the source file. So once you tap on it, it takes to the download section. So here you need to wait for the link. So your download will start shortly. So within 3 seconds your download will get started. So we can see that the download is started. So once after this you need to download the Rufus. But before that let us go to the downloads and check it out. So here you could find that your Bliss OS is downloading. So you need to have some patience. So if you have a fastest internet your download might be fast. If you have a poor network connection your download may be slow. Now let us download the Rufus. So open new tab and type download Rufus. So you could find the first official website. You need to enter that and scroll down. So here you could find the link. You just need to tap on it. So as you can see the Rufus is downloaded. Let me show it in the download. So as you can see the two different files are downloaded. For a better understanding let me paste this in the desktop. So here. So these are the two different files required to install Bliss OS. So firstly let us open the Rufus. So you just need to click on yes or you can even click on no if you don't want any online updates. So here you need to connect your pen drive. So make sure you connect your pen drive at least 8 GB or in 16 GB. So let me connect mine. So as you can see now my pen drive is directed. So now you need to add your ISO image or your disk. So you need to click on select and select your ISO image which is pasted in the desktop. So let me click on open. So once it is done you need to click on start and click on ok and yes. So as you can see now our device is getting ready. So you need to have some patience. So once it is done you could eject your pen drive and install it in your PC. So I'll show you how to do that. So it is time to eject. So you need to close the application and eject your pen drive. So once the ejection is done, make sure you connect the pen drive to your PC or your laptop. So now it is time for installing. So you need to click the boot manager key. So it is Dell, F12 or F2 which it depends on your PC. So now you need to go to the save and exit. So here you could find the option called boot override. So I have put it in the SanDisk pen drive. So let me click on SanDisk. So here is an important step you need to follow. So that is go to advanced option. So this is a Bliss OS. So what you need to do is go to advanced option and click on enter. So here you could find the option called auto installation auto install to specified hard disk. So you need to click on enter. So as you can see now it is installing and now you need to format your hard disk. Ok now you need to select the hard disk. The first one is the pen drive and second one is your hard disk. So just scroll down or just go to the second one and click on enter and click on yes. So as you can see now it is formatting your partition it means that it is clearing all the files which is in your hard disk. So once after the formatting is done now it is time for checking. So here it has two different options that is run bliss OS or reboot so you can click on run bliss OS. So now this is the startup of the Bliss OS. So you just you don't need to click any button. So it automatically redirects you to the setup. So this is the logo of Bliss OS. Looks very cool, right? So the animation is very cool. So now let us wait for some time. So you need to wait for some time. Some people might exit in this setup. They may tell it is not working or it is just in the startup. But here it takes some long time to enter. So once after this is done, you're ready to use your device and ready to rock. So we finally have the Bliss OS here. It looks very cool, right? So these are some applications which are inbuilt in the Bliss OS. So here we have message, contacts, desktop, mode, notepad, play store and also play games. So there are a lot of features and also it has got a lot of transition effects, themes, desktop options, layout and launches. So you can really enjoy the Bliss OS. So this is all about the Bliss OS.
So if you have any doubts in installing the OS, comment it down in the comment section. I'll surely help you how to solve it. So if you have any doubts in installing the OS or if you have any facing any error, comment it down in the comment section. I'll surely help to resolve your problems and I'll reply to your comments. So if this video was helpful, please give the video a thumbs up, hit the like and subscribe button and suggest us what to do in the next video. Until the state and those wish for some DB tickets.